hi welcome to today's class many looking at this exponential equation you can tell the answer but how do you solve this in less than one minute i will show you the trick now i know you are used to you know using this to open this in other words rewriting this to give you 4 to the power of x times 4 to the power of 2 yeah 4 to the power of x times 4 to the power of 5 but that is the wrong way We'll be solving this the wrong way so let's take our solution from here let me show you the trick to this so we have our 4 x plus 2 all you need to do is to factor this from this expression so we have bracket if you use this to divide this you're left with 1 plus use this to divide this then this will give you 4 to the power of 3 this is equal to 65 confused no now look at what i just did here now now, if you use this to divide this, we'll have your 4 to the power of x plus your 5, all of our 4 to the power of x plus 2. The basis are the same. So this will give us here 4 to the power of x plus 5 minus x minus 2. Right? So this, this leaves, so we are left with 4 to the power of what, 3, 5 minus 2. So that's what I did here. This is the best trick ever so from here you now have here 4 to the power of x plus 2 plus 4 to the power of 3 we give us 64 64 plus 1 we give us what 65 this is equal to 65 divide both side by 65 equally divide the side by 65 this this leaves this this leaves so you now have 4 to the power of x plus 2 is equal to what 1 this is base 4 bring it base 4 here so you can write this as equal to 4 to the power of 0 any number raised to the power of 0 is 1 except 0 okay because 0 to the power of 0 is undefined so from here the bases are the same so these these leave the system so we now have x plus 2 is equal to 0 x therefore is equal to minus 2 So this is one of the coolest way of solving this without wasting much time. So this is all I have for you for today. Thanks. Bye for now.